deep in the heart of the earth, a dream is waiting. Deep in the soul of the soul, it is awakened. We of the earth hear her call and we answer. She is the music and we My name is Zelda Hotelling. Creator gave me a lot of gifts to explore in this lifetime. The gifts of being a visionary, a dreamer. I am also a drum maker, basket maker. I teach in schools on the First Nation people. I went to uh, be with my grandmother from like nine years old. Uh, to around 13, 14, I used to stay up there every summer on the reservation up in Kahnawake in Canada. And that's how I started uh, doing a lot of beadwork and basket making and drum making. And then it just went into bigger, bigger um, mixed media through string weavings, and then it became the vision. Well, this, this here is um, the Sacred Dream Circle project that came to me about seven years ago and uh, really touched my heart in a deep way. When I was working on this piece, the first one, the energy was moving through my hands where it was the spirit um, of Creator just coming through my hands and I, and I was just allowing that energy to come through. I was like a hollow bone in a way they call it, where it came right through my hands. My hands were 
inspired to keep going. So I would work on this for hours and hours. I would go in like a trance. I was constantly, constantly moving, moving, singing, singing. And every knot is a prayer. Every knot represents a galaxy. That's what was uh, told to me. The further I go, the further somebody else could go to. They could look at this piece like an art piece. They could look at it as a healing piece, or they can feel it and journey with this piece too. When I do set them up, it's all about you can meditate, you can visually sit with them and view them, or you can feel them help you heal whatever it is that is needed that's in your life. In the beginning, the name was Shifts Happen in Three, because I was only going to do the three. And then it went beyond. Shifts Happen in Threes and Beyond. As I got to the 13, it was called the Sacred Dream Circles. And then as we were growing throughout the years, it's the Sacred Dream Circles of the Great Open Door. And, um, and now we're at the 21 of them. So after seven years of working and being guided, when this vision came in for the 21st one, a spirit of an elder, a grandmother, stood next to my bed and said, you have now completed the 21 Council of the Blue Star. And I just had this big sigh of just knowing that is finally done. I felt like a disconnection where there was, um, there wasn't that like push, that little bit of drive to keep moving forward. It was like I was freed up. I had my freedom back, but I didn't even know what to do with it because I was so busy constantly in this spiral of keep continuing making them for seven years. It's like all of a sudden you let a kid go to college and it's, there's nothing, there's nothing. I cried, I was lost, I felt very empty, but at the same time I felt so full with so much love. It was like, Waves of energy, of emotions, of loss and grieving, but being so fulfilled at the same time. And now it's time for my kids, that's why I call them my kids, to go to college now. They need to go out into the world. They need to explore the world. They need to meet the people they need to meet.